So the file administration, uh, so as you can see, there are two trees. The, the tree of the website of pages, the, it's this tree here. And the tree of the file administration. So all the files you have, you have to store them here. You have to store them on the file administration. We recommend that you use the same tree as the pages, as the page tree, in order for you to uh, retrieve easily your files. So these files um, are the files that you uh, insert on your web pages to download. And uh, please don't don't mistake the files that you upload uh, to for the pages for the pages content. For example, let me see if there is. And don't don't mistake it with the files of the deliverables. So, when you are building your pagings, uh, first upload all the files you wish to uh, to upload on the pages. This is just the content part. To manage the deliverables, you have to upload your files on this folder that is called library. We have seen some projects that have uh, inserted the. the uploaded their deliverables, for example, on this root, this root folder that has, for example, we have here uh, on this project, for example, application forms, steering and technical committees, procedures, all these files should go to this folder here, which is the library. We also have seen projects that have started to upload deliverables on uh, folders that that are uh, attached to pages, and that's that's not uh, that's not our our view. You should upload all your deliverables inside files inside this folder library. And the rest of the, for example, in the news, we would recommend, for example, to create a, a folder for each news. If you have pictures, if you have uh, uh, documents and the same thing for the events because after a while of the project if, if you store uh, randomly all the files it will be uh, confusing in the end you have many files and it's difficult to find them so it's better that you create uh, a basic structure like the website the tree and uh, that you create for example for the news and events uh, folders for each news for each event and that you use properly the library folder where you upload first your files for the deliverables. So to use the, you can manage this, um, the tree of the file administration with right clicking, right clicking on a folder for example, and you can see that there is this contextual menu, it's called contextual menu, but through this uh, menu, you can edit, you can add uh, folders, you can copy folders, you can cut, delete, and you, for example, if you want to rename a folder, you just click twice over it, and you change the name of the folder. This is quite simple. Also, you can move. Uh, no, you can't. It's also here that you create the galleries of uh, pictures. So um, we will show you later how to do this. So I'm just going to upload a file. Uh, for example, I just put it here on data. I'm, not seeing open. I'm sorry, I have to switch because OpenDOS is online. I'm using uh, Kamarg website, it's better because of offline. So I'm just uploading a file here on data. It's very simple. You just click here, for example, on this 
and this button which is upload files and you can drag and drop the file into it I'm just uh, picking a file here that we brought for you dropping the file and you have to wait until a green light message appears so this green light means that the, the file was correctly uploaded so here it is here and make sure that you have um, make sure that you have the uh, this all these uh, options uh, selected so the extended view but to see the details of of, um, of each file <clears throat> the files um, you can make many things with the files so for example you can replace the file if you replace the file uh, the links uh, that are already set on the pages they will they will be kept they won't change so for example you can replace any file and uh, and the link will be the same you can rename the file here for example you you can obtain here the information about the file so when it was created where it is <clears throat> you can copy the file elsewhere or you can cut it or you can delete it when you click on it you have an editor about the file and you can add more information on, on the file if you wish you can give uh, a title so for example instead of having the the when for, uh, we have seen for example in the in the, uh, the Liverpool's library uh, files that have the title of the file you can change that you can put more a more communicational file for example a document concerning document data it won't have any underscores any uh, events and things things like that it's more it's more beautiful to see the title like this this is just uh, metadata you can you can uh, put a copyright you can insert uh, the file language here or the communication please this uh, it's uh, this is not the part concerning the deliverables. It's just files, uh, any file that you upload on your uh, on your website. So afterwards, when you change, when you edit the file, you have to save it. So going into the folder to see the changes. So the file will is. Uh, appears like this but in front it will appear with the, the actual title uploading files on the pages will show it on the part of the content of Okay. I'll see. So we have a question here that is moving a file from a folder to another folder. I'm just picking some. I'm just uploading here the file we have done. It's better because it's the best file. <clears throat> So we just cut it. We have to wait a bit. And we want to change it to this, uh, this library folder, for example. So the, the file appears here on the clipboard, as you can see. Uh, and
you paste it here through this button. And it's it has changed its folder, so it, it isn't anymore here. So as you can see, it's not anymore here. It's now in the library. Unfortunately, there isn't the drag and drop uh, possibilities here with the folder, with the files. So you have to do this operation of uh, cut or copy and paste into using the buttons uh, that are. Uh, in the clipboard. Okay, so uh, just this part of the. So this is all about the files. The files. Please also don't mistake in this web tree, this folder tree, with the. Uh, for example, there have been some mistaken uh, with this part, which is the, these folders that appear here in the, the website tree. Because the website tree has several kinds of pages that I'm going to explain later, and there is uh, folders also here. But this, these folders here, they store uh, dynamic records. They don't store files. So the fi all files have to be stored in the file administration, which is this green uh, module on the left column. So some tips about managing files. When deleting a folder, you have to delete the files inside first, for example, so because it, will, it won't let you delete the folder. Build a folder tree similar to the page tree. Use the contextual menu to be easier for you to manage your files. And upload the files of your deliverables in the folder library. That's all.